All right, guys. So this is the entrance to the to the airport, and we got this sign here for now, which is called Niemeyer Aviation, which is the owner and he owns the property and stuff like that. So we're gonna get our sign that's gonna go right on the bottom of this for our club, and this is the entry point. It's very convenient location, right off of uh, Highway 65 and Ridge Road. So you would go east on Ridge Road, and then it takes you to this street right here, which is Lake Park Avenue. You make a left, you can't forget it because there's a cemetery. Coincidentally, Winnemac is right next to a cemetery too, uh, Winnemac Field. So we got a cemetery here too. Uh, anyway, so you would you'd be coming east on Lake Park Avenue and you would make a left here, right where the sign is, and then that takes you to the airport. All right, guys, so this is the uh, second half of the video. Uh, this is going to be the hangar. Uh, well, he's got his rural plane there, but we could probably put our models in here. Uh, it's got a pretty cool sliding gate open like this. So yeah, it's a big facility. I can't wait to do the, the vents and stuff. We have a lot of parking. Uh, we have restaurants, food, and all that stuff. We're literally 45 minutes from downtown Chicago, so it's not even that bad of a commute if someone was to fly in, at, or if, even closer if they land at Midway. To come from Midway here is very even closer. But um, yeah, we got a twin Piper in here. Yep. All right, guys, I'm at the field or the airport. Uh, I'm going to fly the chopper real quick just to do a little quick demo. Uh, I had the Hawk on earlier, but I have to redo the video because the button got accidentally pressed. So I'm going to fly the chopper. Uh, we're supposed to be at the, well, eventually we're going to be at the runway, which is over there. But for now, we're just hanging out here. Uh, just gonna, I, wanted, I wanted to show Don's wife uh, how this thing works. And then uh, after that, we'll do the jet again, taxi it up and down just to kind of get an idea of the, the airport here uh it's a really large place uh we're gonna we're gonna clean it up uh so hopefully within a week or two uh once the paperwork will get done uh starting i already started the process today so hopefully by the end of the week or next week we'll be ready to rock and roll joe it's already on just hold it <laughs> don't press the buttons what you're here just, just hold it i'm just gonna hover it for them yeah it's it's there Okay, so this one's uh, electric operated. It doesn't really make any noise, it's a bit quiet. Might touch some of that over there. This one's a little bit higher head speed. Pretty stable, huh? Pretty stable. You, know, you have blade control or just, just right here? Oh, uh, yeah, I have pitch control, yeah. Okay, blade control. No, not, no RPM control. RPM is uh, fixed right now. I got you. But I could lower the head speed. Like, this is high idle. Yeah, I'll talk to you after I... Uh... So, all right, let me get in the, you see the numbers going, right? Is that the numbers going? Oh, yeah, it's going. Okay, good. All right, guys. Turn this thing on. Hello, everybody. I'm here at the new field. We're gonna call this the Robart, uh, Hobart Sky Ranch Jet Club. That's gonna be the new name. We're not gonna use the US 30 Jet Club. We're gonna change it over. The owner requested that we have something where we're at, so we're gonna do it that way. Um, this place is huge. We have a 3,200 foot runway, out of which we're we'll probably utilize maybe a thousand. Or 1200 feet of it so we're at literally a uh, little bit less than the halfway mark here Joe if you can pan that way so pan that way so my truck is right now parked in the taxiway the big white truck so we're gonna keep that as the turnaround point as a marker for now 
I'm not gonna fly the aircraft today. It's just a little taxi run, just to get this little video going. But just to you know show the facility and then some of the stuff we need to up, update and stuff like that, and where, where people are gonna park their cars and where the flight line is gonna be. We're gonna kind of go over that today. But no actual flight will happen today. I'm just gonna start it up and just run it back and forth just to show the facility for now. So let me start it up. That's just uh, taxi speed right now. I'm gonna bring it back. A little bit bumpy there, so we're gonna we're gonna address all these issues. Um, so she comes back. Now we're gonna go the other way. Yeah, just a little divot there. A little bumpy there. This way. Yeah, so it's plenty of space. I mean, this is a really large area. So the idea is to use this uh, the the strip here, and we're gonna pretty much fly eastbound, uh, pretty much over where the trees and stuff are. Well, the trees are quite a distance there. I would say a good seven, eight hundred feet away. Oh shoot, I hope I can make it turn around. Oh, it's in the grass. I mean, I should have did a little bit more of a better turn, but here we go. Alright, we're back out. Here we are. Yeah, here he is. Is it the break? So, that's just a little demo of the area. You guys got to see the facility. We got some spectators in the background right now, um, but this is going to be fun. Uh, needs a little bit of a work, but all right, it's fine. We'll turn it off now. 